<laughs> Hi guys, what's up? It's Emma, and in today's video, Katie and I are in Florida. We are filming a come thrift with me. We've mapped out the sketchiest thrift locations <laughs> in St. Augustine. We're currently at a thrift store slash pet rescue, and we're gonna see if we can find some good stuff. I've um, never been thrifting in Florida before, so I'm very excited. Any words? I mean, like, I was all for it, but then we saw the inside, and I kind of got scared, but I think it's gonna be good. We saw a dog on the way in, so. It might be ho hoarders. <laughs> oh my god. We're also on edge because of bugs, and because we went to sketch the movie theater of our life last night. Mm -hmm. Almost didn't make it out alive, but blessed to say that we did. So. It was worth it. So we're gonna go thrifting and see what we can find. Um, if you want to see us thrift some cool stuff, then just keep watching. So they didn't have any really good things for thrifting, but they did have dogs. One of them couldn't walk. And I almost cried in the store. So yeah. <laughs> this is not good. We're gonna go find a different thrift store now and hopefully not cry. Now we're going to get coffee. I also busted on camera. What? Looks bad in real life. Yeah. shop and then we found a goodwill and as you guys know um goodwills and i have a very long detailed relationship and i basically love them so they've never done me dirty and i'm really excited because i love goodwill i am like three shades paler than you especially in this lighting i kind of have tan line here i okay, don't there's no need to flex, flex. i don't think i see it right there yeah we're gonna go to goodwill and thrift and i can't wait um goodwill doesn't have any pets but hopefully it has good clothes Clink. back at the homeland have a bob I'm feeling good Did someone say a Sarah McKean sponsorship? <laughs> so I have a small little load right here. You can tell that I went for some crazy Florida prints. All these are like half old lady, half kind of cool. Here's a little bit outfit of the day. Jacket Fashion Nova, tube top, sunburn, Florida. Cheap shop brandy, brandy, fashion nova, Air Force One. I mostly found pieces that I think I'm gonna like DIY or up vamp, revamp, upcycle. Some hardcore Florida grandma vibes, pink, stripes, florals, this cool one in the back. Then I have a Nike t-shirt, kind of Versace a little bit, more like paisley, turned into a tube top maybe. And I found this cute little sweatshirt, it's like color blocking, could be cool. Here's a sweatshirt, it's pretty cute in the outside. It has like teal and blue and it says athletic something on it. it. Has like this cool black scuba diving vibe almost on it. Really super soft, really comfy. Kind of works the whole outfit, honestly. Then we have this boat neck paisley t-shirt. It's all right, but I kind of want to see what it would look like if I flip it and here it is a tube top. Honestly, it has potential, it's not the worst. And I have this oversized pink, like Hawaiian crepey material. I don't know why, but I love the pattern on it. It has shoulder pads in it. Could maybe sew it into like a floral asymmetrical tube top type deal. I just like the pattern a lot. I feel like if I could craft this set, it could make it really cute because this is like full length, like grandma ish. But honestly, belt, cut, cut. Maybe I can make it work. I actually might try this because it seems kind of fun. I just, I'm a sucker for two pieces. Even though it's kind of grandma floral, like kind of, kind of into it. Or I could take the skirt and make kind of like a midi dress type deal as long as I belt it, but. This print, like, ugly, but I don't know why I'm so entertained by it. Everything has potential. End of story. I feel like I should be a tour guide inside a rainforest cafe. But why is it so cool? <laughs> Sorry, just didn't mean to stunt so hard. I said I look like a tour guide at a rainforest cafe. Yeah, like, low key, you just kind of, like, shorten the legs. If I wear it backwards, it turns into a turtleneck. Dude, I don't know why I like it so much. It's really ugly, but I'm getting it, so. Here's a little Nike V-neck star action. Kind of, I kind of like it, actually. Everything I do just involves scissors. It's either a tube top or a crop because I am not talented, so. Probably had this shirt in 2007. That's what we like to see. Um, kind of like the fit, so. Okay, so I got, we got some, I mean, Katie got more than I did, but I found some pretty cool things. I got this Nike t-shirt with a V-neck. So, first purchase, kind of questionable. It's a really small 
like golf thing, kind of unit vibes maybe. I don't even know if she charged me for it. Which is questionable. Play suit. Just because I think it's fun. This is the most Ford outfit I've ever seen and I feel like I just, I want to do her justice so I got it. And my, I, $6, like $3 each. It was so worth it. I got a Boston t-shirt which is kind of like controversial because it's, we're just not in Boston. I got a Washington DC shirt. I'm literally from the DC area. I don't know why I got this but I did and we're just going with it. It's really big. Last but not least, this sweatshirt. It's like kind of quirky and weird. Now we're trying to find somewhere to eat for lunch and then maybe hit another thrift store slash Goodwill and then we also have to go tour the lighthouse. Uh -huh. Also, my thrift purchase was she as says, much as my coffee. Yeah, also I swear on God, the kookaburra is the bird that's in Jesse or camped or something and if you know what I'm talking about, please comment down below because I think it's real. Thank you. Hi guys, that's Emma and I just realized that I never filmed an outro for this video. I am now at home. I'm in Richmond. And I'm wearing this. It's like 2 in the morning. I just like kind of miss this outfit to be honest. I don't know why I like it so much, but like I think it's fun. The more that I wear it, the more like that I definitely look like an Animal Kingdom greeter. Like pop a name tag on me and I'm like... But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Kate and I filmed an outro in the car, but like you can barely hear it and it wasn't very good. Drop a comment, a like, subscribe, all the good stuff. Make sure to subscribe for some upcoming content. I know I've been kind of lacking lately. I've just not been... Honestly, to be deep for like four seconds, I haven't really been happy lately and I haven't been happy with what I've been putting out and stuff and like you can like kind of tell my videos. I'm trying to get my shit together. It's been a lot. College has been an adjustment. I'm trying to find my happy place. I have some really fun stuff lined up. I'm going to California next week and that'll be a fun vlog. Um, I feel like my life's actually finally coming together and I'm making fun stuff and I'm more happy about it and I feel like I'm making the content like I used to make it and I hope you guys notice that it's better because I like it a lot more. Whatever. Yeah, if you want to see more come thrift with me, make sure to subscribe. I'll be doing another one soon. I'm actually going thrifting tomorrow in Richmond at the OG Goodwill, so I'm super excited about it. Um, I love you guys so much. Thank you for sticking with me, and I will see you either this week or next week, who knows, with a new video. Peace.